Hi everyone, we are at the Rite Aid and we're going to go in and do some deals. We're going to have to go old school. Okay, we're going to throw back to the olden days of using paper coupons to lower our out-of-pocket and to get our total up to $50 so that we can use the spend 50, get $10 back in bonus cash barcode. So Rite Aid doesn't want to go digital with us anymore, so we're going to have to throw it back to the paper day. So let's go in and shop. Okay, we're going to pick up the set of fill lotion at $13.99 and the cleanser is $13.99, but they're buy one, get one half off. And we're going to use our $4 off coupons. And when we buy two, we're going to get $3 back in bonus cash and $1.50 each on Ibotta. Then as a filler item, we're going to pick up two of these vitamin E sticks. At $2.99, buy one get one free, and use a $3 off two paper coupon. We're also going to pick up two Haas cough drops, two for five. We will use a $1.25 off two coupon, and we'll get a dollar back in bonus cash. Okay, so they have a lot of Valentine stuff, but there's no Easter stuff. There's no summer stuff. And you know how usually at the beginning of the year, they always have their, all the summer stuff coming in. All the ice chests, the umbrellas, all that. There's nothing. This is one of the seasonal aisles and there's nothing here. So this is kind of telling to me that we may not be continuing into Easter and summer. Now here's some stuff, but this is just kind of their, they always have this. Okay, we are back and it worked out good, except I messed up and I forgot to give the spend 50, get $10 back in bonus cash barcode because we were throwing it back. It was throwback Thursday, so we we're throwing it back to paper days and I totally forgot to give that barcode. So I'll try to contact customer service um, tomorrow and hopefully I'll get that $10 back. But I spent so low out of pocket, they may not do it to, for me, but I'll try. It was wonderful because my favorite checker in the entire world was working and I was able to use a five off 24 old expired Catalina coupon. Not that expired, it was only expired like on the, like a few days. Um, but she'll take pretty much anything as long as it scans and she did and so that worked out so fantastic It was just great except for that Not doing the barcode. So this is everything that I got Old school paper coupons big shout out and thank you to couponing with grace for this idea that she showed me on the old spice I picked up four of them. They were on clearance. They weren't Super cheap. Three of them were three dollars and fourteen cents. The Pure Sport. I got three of those at three fourteen. This one was only twenty five percent off, and it was four seventy one. I picked up four of them. I had an eight dollar off four coupon that we got out of those gift sets a while back, and it does expire the end of this month, which is quickly approach approaching. So I was happy to use that. The coupon worked beautifully. $8 off four, so that was fantastic. I showed you the set of fill in store. I did that, $13.99, buy one, get one 50% off. Use the two $4 off coupons and got $3 back in bonus cash for buying two, as well as $1.50 for each one on Ibotta for a total of $3. And I needed a shower cap, so I picked up a shower cap for $4.59. And then the cheapest other thing was the hair nets for $2.79. I always say I need a hair net when I'm cooking because my hair gets into everything. So I might even try it while I'm cooking. Um, and then when you buy two, you get $3 back in bonus cash. So that was great. And then I did the hauls that I showed you, which was two for five. I used the $1.25 off two coupon and got a dollar back in bonus cash. I picked up four of the Nature's Truth Vitamin E Sticks at $2.99. Buy one, get one free. I used a three off two insert coupon as well as $1.50 off one. Two of those on 
that I got from coupons.com. So um, they were free and they were a great filler to get up to 50. Um, so here's my receipt. Up top we have the Old Spice um, at 314. Then we have the hair nets at two. Oh, they were only two thirty nine for the hair nets. They were supposed to be two seventy nine, but they rang up two thirty nine. So, uh, yeah. Then we have the other two old spices at three fourteen, and the other one at four seventy one. Then we have the other Conair, the shower cap that I really desperately needed at four fifty nine. There's the five off 24. I had a couple more and I couldn't find them in my coupon box. They were in a special compartment in my purse so that I wouldn't lose them and I would be able to find them when I needed them, but I couldn't find them when I needed them. And then we have the hauls at 250 uh, for each one with $1.25 off two. And then we have the all the vitamin E sticks at $2.99, buy one, get one free. Then we have the Cetaphils at $13.99, buy one, get one 50% off, and the $4 off coupons. So with tax, I paid $28.55, all bonus cash. I only had to pay $0.55 cents of real money, which was very exciting, but I only got $7 back in bonus cash, wonk, 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 because I forgot to give that barcode, and I got 500 and something points, which will put me up to the next level. This is my sister's card. She's gonna, she will convert those points to um, bonus cash, so it'll be an additional two dollars back. So if I would have done that, I would have spent twenty-eight fifty-five, got back seventeen in bonus cash, plus two um, for the points conversion, which would have made it nineteen. So that makes everything nine dollars, but then three dollars back on Ibotta for the Cetaphil. So everything, including tax, was only six dollars and change. And that's exciting because I got my shower cap that I was going to have to go buy anyway. So really, really happy about this haul. If it comes through, if when I contact customer service and they actually um, award those points or the bonus cash, that's going to be fantastic. If they don't, that's just going to have to be the way it is. I need to reduce this bonus cash anyway. So... Um, either way, I look at all this free because it was just the bonus cash that was from her card and I was happy to reduce it down, get some of my Bada deals, get the shower cap that I needed, and um, try to pare down and only be down to one card. So I'm happy about this haul. Even if I don't get that extra $10 back, I'm still thrilled. So thank you all so much for watching are you guys gonna go continue to go to Rite Aid this week they as I showed you in the store they have no Easter stuff and they have no summer stuff and I asked one of the um, ladies that work there hey where's all the Easter and the summer stuff and she said oh that's all gonna come together uh, we're waiting we're still waiting on it but people think we're closing but we're not closing so so I hope that 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 is the truth I hope that they do not close so um, I'd rather fight with an open store than not fight with a closed store. I'd rather fight the manager, although I don't want to fight the manager, but I would rather have an open store with a manager I don't like than a closed store with no manager at all. So thank you all so much for watching. We'll see you on the next video. Everybody have a safe, wonderful, and happy rest of your Thursday. Bye.